sustainability and climate change are global challenges. There is now a growing focus on how companies perform and report on these matters. Many important initiatives exist also at the regional level. But when the challenges are global, the most optimal would be global solutions together with regional initiatives. There is an increasing number of calls for standardization and comparability of reporting on these matters. The IFRS Foundation has also been asked to play a role in this area. The reason is its work on financial reporting standards, which are implemented fully or partly in 144 countries. At the IFRS Foundation, the trustees review the strategy every five years. We are preparing for such a review now. And this is an opportunity and also duty for us to consider now key strategic issues. We have decided to look at sustainability as a separate topic in this context. And this is why we have prepared a consultation paper which just has been published. The first question is the demand for sustainability standards in global level. If the replies lead to a positive consensus, another question follows. Should the IFRS Foundation play a role in this area? Our consultation paper sets out possible ways forward if the IFRS Foundation is asked to play a role. One option is to establish a new separate sustainability standards board. This board would sit alongside the International Accounting Standards Board within the IFRS Foundation. But for this to be successful, several conditions should be met. Support is needed from public authorities, global regulators and other market stakeholders. A new board should work with regional initiative authorities to achieve global consistency and reduce complexity in reporting. An important precondition is an appropriate level of resources, including separate funding. The process could build gradually, starting with the focus on climate-related reporting standards. Naturally, the work would take into consideration existing developments and various initiatives in the field. I still want to reiterate this is a demand-driven process. If the demand exists, then we will look to examine how to move forward. But for now, we encourage you to participate in this consultation.